<laughs> Hello there, my name is Logan News, and today I'll be using geometry to disprove a modern day icon, King Kong. By using the geometry and the fundamental theorem of similarity, on my side, I can prove that he is wrong. <clears throat> the fundamental theorem of similarity has two parts in it. Having G be the original measurement, as in area, length, volume, and K the ratio of the two objects. In this case, King Kong and Gorilla. Length follows K times G in the one dimension. Area is two dimensions, so it's K squared multiplied by G. And volume in the third dimension is K cubed multiplied by G. Now let's talk about that beast. An average gorilla weighs about 300 pounds and is about three and a half feet tall when he's on all fours. According to measurements in the original movie, King Kong is seven times that. <clears throat> that made the K value seven. <clears throat> so King Kong's weight, which follows the volume equation, would be 300 times seven cubed, or about 103,000 pounds. Which isn't bad, but when you look at his bone strength, which isn't proportional to the, his weight, because it follows the cross-sectional area, which follows the area equation. That will make it g to multiply by 7 to square. As you can see, his bones would have to withstand 7 times that of an average gorilla. That is not good. Put that in perspective, that would be like an average gorilla weighing 300 pounds, carrying something 7, seven times that, 7 times that, which is about 2,100 pounds for an average car. <clears throat> that would make it difficult for him to even get up, let alone climb up the Empire State Building. Now let's talk about what you, what would you need to feed him. An average ape needs to eat eight, one eighth his weight. For King Tom, that's about 12,800 pounds a day. Now let's start with the breakfast snack. A Pop-Tart is about 1.75 ounces, ounces, or 9 Pop-Tarts in 1 pound. So you take those 9 Pop-Tarts, multiply by the pounds per day, and you get 115,758 Pop-Tarts a day. That's a lot of Pop-Tarts. <clears throat> so let's put this in geometry terms. Let's say the average Pop-Tart is 3 by 5 inches. So it is 15 inches squared. So you take those 15 inches squared and multiply it by the Pop-Tarts per day. And that equals two Pop-Tarts that are the size of NBA basketball courts. Can you imagine eating Pop-Tarts that big? Let's say King Kong is a traditional ape and he likes his bananas. An, a, a, an average banana weighs 5.33 ounces or three bana bananas in a pound. In a pound. That is three multiplied by the pounds per day, which is 38,586 bananas per day. That's a lot of tests. Now let's bring volume into this. The volume of one banana is about one third cup. So one third cup multiplied by the bananas per day is about 12,862 cups of banana per day. Now the average smoothie has about two cups in it. So that would be 6,431 smoothies per day of banana puree. In conclusion, there is no need to fear of apes running amok in your city because geometry has proven that King Kong would collapse under his own weight and there would be no way for him to sustain his appetite. Thank you.